The Intercontinental Championship held by over a dozen WWE Hall of Famers. The likes of Stone Cold Steve Austin, Shawn Michaels, Bret Hart. Well, that title symbolizes the workhorse of WWE. Well, certainly has a history of being the largest stepping stone any individual can climb. Known to put superstars on the map. All facts that these men know very well. Now oh, trampling the opposition. Knee drop. That was nasty. So precise. Boom! What a kick! Brings a rush of blood to the head. The Miz has been an A-lister for almost half his life. He made his first reality TV appearance in 2001 and has been a fixture on televisions worldwide ever since. For the Miz in this match, how important is his experience as a decorated WWE veteran? Well, the Miz also has years of wily tactics and underhanded tricks up his sleeve. He's won plenty of big matches that way. Could be the same here. Corey brought us back to the beginning of the millennium for the Miz's first reality show appearances, but his entry into WWE was also on a reality show. Tough enough. The Miz is Tough Enough's greatest ever alumni, and he brought his career full circle as a host and judge on 2015's return of Tough Enough. Now that is awesome! The Miz looking a little stunned here. If he can hold the line here, he'll be in a good position. Oh, the reversal by The Miz. A quick reversal by Kalisto. Lightning fast. Uh-oh, sunset flip. And shoulders are down. He's got plenty of gas left in the tank. Yeah, he's not done yet. It's common knowledge that a smaller superstar like Kalisto should be no match for some of the giants in WWE. Should being the operative word there, Michael. We've seen Kalisto defeat big men before who should have beat him. Yet another counter. It's like they're both somehow one step ahead of each other. Power bomb! Is it enough? The and the Miz, the quick cover. And the Miz, the quick cover. Kalisto with an easy kick out there. Making those south of the border fans proud. A back suplex. In a bad way here, guys. He's got him up on his shoulders. Rolling fireman's carry. Uh-oh. Phoenix Flash! Oh gosh, how'd he do that? Masterful execution by the Miz. Oh, Miz drops him down. Miz gonna go for the figure four. Will he tap out? Too the rope. close to the ropes. There's the cover. Can he do it? Kalisto with an easy kick out there. Too early in the match to end it. Man, Kalisto, what offense. On a kick. The Miz, here we go, Byron. Oh, man, I got chills right now. Byron mentioned how Kalisto has wins over some of WWE's largest men, and that fact puzzles me. Simple physics tells us that Kalisto should be an easy W for the mammoths of WWE. Well, it seems like Kalisto doesn't follow the rules of physics, Corey. Oh, oh are you oh kidding me? Back of his neck. We are seeing a lot of guts, a lot of determination out there. You have to wonder where that one turning point to end this will come from. On a oh, kick. The power of Lucha Libre, courtesy. Cover, cover. Kicks out at two. So resourceful. Kalisto is playing mind games now, and it seems to be having an effect. Oh, the reversal by the Miz. 
I don't know what he has planned out here, but he must be mindful of the referee's count. This is some great offense by Kalisto. And gentlemen, The Miz may be fading away here. He was the favorite for this match, but that's changing rapidly. And he's heading back in. Close line! Splash! Massive! gentlemen, Kalisto. Now let's take another look at these guys in action. And Kalisto has to be proud of that performance. Oh, you're absolutely right, Byron. Thanks for tuning in for this championship match, and what an amazing match it was.